Hello and welcome to the ICC Arena. It is 100% a shameless rip of the Mings Arena. We're actually using his ROM, so thank you. I ended up getting permission that I can make my own version of the arena, so here we are. So instead of actually doing live streams and putting gladiators up, I decided that I was going to do something that I've always thought about doing as ever since I was like five years old. Taking units from each of the fire emblems and putting them up against each other. So you might recognize some of the classes are a little bit different. Example, you know, Erica is a blade lord and not her casual horse self. It's because I'm using the ROM hack that they have and some of the classes aren't actually available. So I decided to go ahead and jump in the certain classes uh, with as close as I can get it. So we have Erica from Fire Emblem 8. I decided to give her a silver sword, a silver blade, and a lady blade, which is pretty awesome. Her stats at level 10 are insane with the Blade Lord class bases. Like this, this is crazy. Like right now, I know it says she's level 0, but I did a stat calculation of level 10 on just like some basic wiki searches, and this is what she ended up with. Like, it's crazy how strong this girl is. Like, she is super fast, super skillful, and has mediocre, well, I guess she has really high strength if you really wanna go down that route. Now, the one thing I also have to note is that her strength cap is actually really, really low compared to Hector's defense. So I'm really worried about her durability on her weapons, but I think she'll be all right. I mean. She'll end up only doing like five damage multiple times in a row, but I think she's all right. If you guys are ready, I think I'm ready. So she has Astra, which is skill activation, which is 30%, which is actually probably her only reason that she's going to be able to beat Hector. But honestly, with how high her skill and speed is and luck, I don't know about that. Um, she also has Rightful Lord because Erica is truly the Rightful Lord of the GBA series, in my opinion. That or Lynn. We'll have, to do a, we'll have to do a redemption match for Fire Emblem 7 later. Also, Lin would absolutely stomp, but I feel like the stats would be about the same here. I mean, maybe, maybe. Actually, that's a good one. Anyways, uh, so we have Hector, the king from Ostia. Now, as you can see, this man has capped strength and capped defense. This man takes no damage. He has 24 skill, 20 speed, and 11 luck. So he's gonna have a really tough time hitting Lin. However, I gave him Frenzy, so every da four damage he takes, he does an extra point of damage, which is huge for Hector because of his massively large HP pool. Like, this man is so thick, it's insane. And I also gave him Great Shield, which is literally just a defense percentage activation. So, Erica is going to have to eat through 72 HP levels, where, well, Hector probably has zero hit on this girl. So, who do you guys think is going to win? Make sure to comment below, and let's go check it out. Let's get ready to rumble in this shameless rip! Alright, so Hector goes ahead and makes the first move. Now, Lynn is making her first attack. Alright, no Astroproc. Oh, so Hector, no matter what, is getting two. Oh, and Lynn takes her first hit. Okay, so that's three times five damage. Oh, the great shield. Uh-oh, uh-oh. So, like, we have a little bit of crit. Oh, another great shield. The Astro Brock is failing. Uh-oh. Oh, man, dude, there's no way. I didn't realize great shield was going to proc three times there. I guess we get to see skills a little bit more uh, realistic here. But with Hector being able to hit twice, but only having about a one and fourth chance to hit, no freaking shot. Is, she, is this over? Dude, can Erica pull through? Dude, that's crazy. So I ran a test match before this and Erica didn't even get hit. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're, we're in the final game. He somehow has more hit. Oh, it's the con. Oh, no. Honestly, the silver blade switch for Erica is not the play. Dude. Oh, no. Maybe Erica could pull around if she can dodge twice here, and then we can get, like, a double Astroproc. I mean, that's all I could see here, because, like, a double Astroproc with Silver Blade is probably our best bet. Otherwise, I genuinely do not see any other, like, way of her... Oh! Er Dude, he's going for the Killer Axe right now. Dude, it's 32, 32, and 21. That's crazy. Dude, if he hits, that's all he needs to do is, like... 
Hector just... Oh, she's on the pillar. Nope, I think this is Erica's game now. I genuinely think Erica just swung it around. Because, like, there's nothing There's nothing Hector can do if, if she's on the pillar. Like, he just has to rely on great proc and hope that she breaks all of her weapons. It looks like Astra doesn't affect the durability, though, of the uh, weapons that Eric is using. Ooh, dodge. Nice, nice. Okay, the great shield is coming in, like, absolute just clutch here. I don't think... You know what? Thinking about it, I don't think Hector would have had any chance without great shield, though. Like, Erica is just slowly whittling away his defenses. Like... Even with the fact, like, even without Astra, and the finishing blow with the 4% crit. Oh, and Erica cleans up. Now, if you guys enjoy this kind of content, I definitely, definitely, definitely want to make sure that you guys comment down below, and I'd really appreciate it. Let me know if you guys have any matchups throughout the cast that you want. I think I'm going to start doing this a little bit more often. I really enjoy this. It's a lot of fun. So if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, comment, and uh, I'll see you guys next episode.